It's another toy box. Don't play with me. It's a toy box. Y'all thought it was a bench? I literally find little places to stick everything. Um, and it still looks like my place. Look at this, y'all. Boom. At the end of the day, if I can't get it back clean like this, there's an issue. Hey Navy, welcome back to my channel, loves. So we are back with another video. Um, I just uploaded a recent one talking about like my home decor. Cause I know it's been a minute since, ooh. <clears throat> oh, I need some water, a little parched. But yeah, it's been a minute since I had a, like my home decor videos up. Um, but I have been posting on Instagram and I've been getting a lot of questions. So I was like, let me just make like a whole video like talking about everything the whole breakdown okay we're gonna talk about how i'm a mother first <laughs> and a bad b immediately after okay so what i mean by this is that i basically decorated my entire apartment by myself um to make it aesthetically pleasing for me and so i actually posted a tiktok on this and for some reason it's like blowing up like it's almost at two million views but with that came like hundreds of comments and so i wanted to show y'all how i do it like some people are like oh so your son can't play like how does he play with his toys if it's just made for you or like so you don't care about your son's like advancement and like how he learns and plays and it's supposed to be like suiting to him and you're like selfish <laughs> <laughs> even though there were a lot of good comments like people like oh that's so me or how did you do it or what furniture did you find to make it so that it's still nice but you still have a child so with all of that being said i'm here to answer y'all's questions and show you firsthand how i do it so let's get into it so i am literally the finesse queen so okay let's just say my door is open right you walk into my room let's just show you so outside of the door we walk in you see nothing you see a door Voila, but boom, when you close the door, a learning activity for Kaisen, <laughs> okay? Boom, that he plays with literally all the time. And then we turn around and over there in the corner, what do we have? An ottoman? Hmm. Also a storage bin? Hmm. Or it could be a toy box. <laughs> So here we have it, y'all. This right here is literally, it's also a bench. Okay, it's a bench. It is an ottoman. It is a footrest. <laughs> but for my lifestyle, for my motherhood parenting lifestyle, it's a toy box, simple. And it looks neat during the day, that's what I love. Like literally you would never know. But like when Kyson gets active, and he's like all throughout the day, he's not here right now, but like every other day when he's here throughout the day, and I'll insert like clips day and night, it gets crazy of course, like y'all, I just cleaned up. Before I cleaned up, there was toys everywhere. So um, he goes in here and boom, y'all, this is where all the magic is. This is where the magic happens and he has a ball, he pulls all of that out, has a blast with that. By the way, how did I forget to tell y'all? I will link everything in the description box. That way y'all will have a direct link to it and you can just go right there to purchase it. Um, and all this stuff is cheap, y'all know. <laughs> I'm frugal, if you know me, you know. Um, but then we got my bathroom and then in the closet, I'm gonna show y'all like a close up of the closet, but y'all, this is where his clothes are at. So I purposely placed my stuff right here. So this is the first view of my closet coming from my room. And then boom, around the corner, I've placed all Kyson's jackets and coats right here with mini hangers that will also be linked in the bio. And you know, I gotta get my stepping stool. Um, 
these have to be my favorite storage bins you guys it comes in different sizes it's stackable um i didn't want to stack them because obviously the ceiling is right there but to uh, boom all of his clothes y'all night clothes regular clothes and then it literally like snaps back into place super easy so it looks neat and then on the other side we have even more with all of his um like towels and blankets i'll show y'all like it's a perfect amount of space and it's just hidden up at the top of my closet so it's out the way and yeah that's how i do that I almost forgot behind the dresser we got the diaper pail so literally we never smell any dirty diapers we get rid of it it's tucked away and then going back to my room i almost forgot to tell y'all his shoes <laughs> boom baby like your girl really <laughs> your girl really knows how to okay like i really know how to make it happen without nobody knowing like like, I just love how I can have my space, but also make it double as a baby space, and you would never know. Like, I literally have my filing cabinet with all my important documents and just my decor, but I also included him. Like, I love him, and it's like, boom! Workspace, but motherhood. Don't get it twisted, okay? I love this little camera, too. <laughs> Oh, wait, this is my favorite picture, y'all. Hold up. I love this picture of us. That is the objective with all of this. I need sanity. Like, I, I need to have a clean, creative space so I can get the juices flowing. I can really think because when it's just chaotic, which, of course, like, when Kyson's having a ball and doing what he's doing, like, that's fine. But I'm saying at the end of the night, <laughs> At the end of the day, if I can't get it back clean like this, there's an issue because maybe y'all are able to, but I can't function like that. <laughs> so, so I hope that answers some like of the questions that I was getting kind of on like why I did it like that or like why it's not just why he doesn't have more toys. No, he has a lot of more than enough toys because I'm gonna show y'all. I have another toy box. Little do you know, on my balcony. Um, oh yeah, right here, another bin. You know, it's oh, it matches the white decor, but it has more of his stuff in it. His hat, socks, all of that. So I literally find little places to stick everything. Um, and it still looks like my place, you know? Like, uh, that's just so important to me. Um, and so now let's go outside to the balcony so I can show y'all what else we have. So it looks like a bench, right? Right right all i'm gonna do is go i'm gonna chill outside i'm gonna i'm gonna chill it's a seat outside but wait but wait y'all nah baby because we got toys it's another toy box don't play with me it's a toy box y'all thought it was a bench Look, we gonna make it do what it do by any means necessary. And that's just that. <laughs> but no, y'all, for real, like, look. Literally, it zips up all the way. Of course, I had it open, so I was gonna show y'all. But all of his, he has so many more toys under here. This boy has everything you can imagine. And he just has a blast. He just pulls it out, uses the space to, you know, play. And the balcony is actually important because it's what everyone on the outside sees. So I have to keep it like all clean and, you know, put together. So, you know, I had to vacuum it not too long ago. Um, I really need to clean <laughs> this off. I don't know, though. It looks, I don't know, y'all. Is it molded? Oh, I'm all touching it. I'm going to figure out how to clean that off. But I did like vacuum it. And yeah, he also has like cars and bikes and stuff like that. Um... Some of it is at my mom's house, which is very, very close. So he definitely gets his playtime with that. And um, his bike is actually in the house. I just kind of like tuck it away behind the bed next to the ottoman. Wherever it fits in, I just keep it there. Now, y'all, this is for real, for real how I finesse it. Because you see my couch. First of all, this is all adjustable. So I can move. It's hooked in right now. But I can easily. Well, actually, let me just show y'all. So I can lift all of these up and you see how it's hooked in? It lifts and comes out. So I can literally 
pull all of these apart, readjust it, and they all lift up. So it's all storage. <laughs> in here I have like his little swim floaty that he does not use, obviously it's winter time. Look at this, y'all. Boom. All of his diapers, wipes, I just keep restocking and keep it hidden. Uh, what's over here? Yep, we got more toys, some of his bigger toys. And Kyson is literally like old enough and grown enough to where he just comes up here, opens it, he knows where everything is at. He wants his helmet, he'll say helmet and look up in here. <laughs> um, y'all don't mind this one, I think this is some my stuff. Oh yeah, this is some uh, bright in here, y'all. Uh, mama gotta uh, have some storage too, okay? But we gonna ignore that. Oh, I gotta clean that off, okay. But anyways, y'all, yeah, like, these are all of my little secrets, ins and outs, okay. Ignore the random things that you see in a mother's house. We have a dinosaur with a helmet. <laughs> okay, ignore that. But um, yeah, he also has his motorcycle. So of course, like I don't have a place for everything, but he gets his playtime in. So yeah, y'all, that's basically Mm -hmm, how your girl does it <laughs> but no y'all like i hope this was helpful i try to for anyone who is trying to do the same thing i'm trying to kind of like let y'all know how i did it of course there's different options with this type of stuff like different colors for the items that i purchased or different sizes i just did what was aesthetically pleasing to my space and what fit in my space because my space isn't really that big i wanted to really make it like open um and minimalistic <laughs> But also, when we're ready to, you know, get to it, we can do that. So I have my space where I work at. I have my our sleeping space. Me and Kyson um, co-sleep, and then Kyson has his toy area. He has his other areas that he plays in. Like I let him take over. <laughs> I'll be in here working, and he be doing his thing. And then, um, you know, I have our learning time where we read and play with toys together. Like we share a space, but we kind of have our own things going on. If that makes sense. And he's only two. So it really, it really works for me. This really works. It's one of the best decisions I ever made while decorating. Um, I'm glad I did it this way. Um, so it's kind of like still connected. Like I put stuff in different places purposely. So like I put his toy box near my bed. So we, we're still in the same space. And I go outside with him on the balcony all the time and just sit out there with my computer or we sit down on the grass and play with his toys. Like all of that stuff, it just makes it more of a family friendly type of environment so i hope this was helpful you guys let me know if you have any other questions um i hope that addressed everything and yeah i love you guys and i will see y'all in my next video bye navy